Hello, I'm Patrick and I'm here to explain a particular method used to solve in work sums. So let's look at an example and start solving. A can do a work in 30 days, B alone can do it in 40 days. What we do is we find the LCM of 30 and 40 which is 120. So let's say 120 units of work and A has to do in 30 days. So every day he will do how many units of work? 4 units of work. Every day B will do how many units of work? 3 units of work which comes from 120 upon 30 and 120 upon 40 will give you 4 and 3 units of work per day. So together when they work they will complete 7 units of work per day. So to complete 120 work they will take 120 upon 7. So it should be 17 1 by 7. Here they are given A and B can complete a work in 35 days. A alone can do in 60 days. So let's take LCM of 35 and 60 which comes to 420. A can do it in 60 days. So per day they will do 7 units of work. B we do not know how many days. So together they take 35 days. That will be 12 units of work. So that means B will do 5 units of work. Because 7 plus this has to be 12. So number of days taken will be 420 upon 5 which will be 84 days. Here again A can do the work in 25 days. B in 20 days. So LCM is 100. A can do in 25 days. So it will be 4 units of work per day. B can do in 20 days. So it can be 5 units of work per day. They say A started a work and was joined by B after 10 days. That means A worked for 10 days. That means A worked for 4 into 10 has already done 40 amount of work. And then B joined. Together they can do 9 work per day. So to complete remaining 60 work, they will take how many days? 60 upon 9 days which will be 20 upon 3 or 6 1 by 3 days. So total days will be 16 2 by 3 the first 10 days and the next 6 by 1 by 3 days. Here A, B and C can finish the piece of work in 4 days. A alone 12 days, B alone 18 days. So we can take LCM of these 3 4, 12 and 18 which comes to 36. So A can do it in 12 days so which will be 3 units of work per day. B can do it in 18 days which is 2 units of work per day. Together they can do it in 4 days which is 9 units of work. That means C will do how much? 9 minus 5, 4 units of work per day. So 4 units of work, 36 upon 4 will give you 9 days to complete the work. So we get 9 days as the answer. Ram can do it in 8 days, Sham can do it in 12 days. So LCM of 12 and 8 is 24. So Ram in 8 days basically does 3 units of work per day. Sham 12 days can do 2 units of work per day. Together they do 5 units. That means every 2 days they can do 5 units of work per day. Every 2 days they can do 5 units of work per day. So in 8 days they will complete 20 units of work. Then Ram begins. Ram does 3 units of work which is 23 work in ninth day. So left is one unit of work which Sham has to do. Sham does two unit of work in one day. So one unit of work it will take one upon two days. So which will be nine one upon two days. I hope you understood this method. You can try to use in some other sums on work and automatically you will be able to understand it better. If you want to join the WhatsApp group for preparation you can WhatsApp your name and the exam you are preparing for at this number.